This video will explain the definitions of validity and invalidity as recast for truth tables. So recall the definition of invalidity from the second module. An invalid argument is one in which it is possible for all the premises to be true and the conclusion false. We can recast this definition in terms of truth tables as follows. An argument is invalid if and only if there is at least one row on its joint truth table where all the premises are true and the conclusion false. So basically what we're doing in a truth table is we're showing all of the possible combinations of truth values um, for, the, uh, for the simple statements in the argument. And depending on how many simple statements there are, there are different um, combinations of truth values that um, are possible. So we show all the possibilities and then we figure out the truth value for each statement on each row. And if we find a row where all the premises are true and the conclusion is false, then what we've done is we have shown how it is possible for all the premises to be true and the conclusion false and therefore the argument is invalid. Likewise with validity. So recall the definition of validity from the second module. A valid argument is one in which it is impossible for all the premises to be true and the conclusion false. We can recast this definition in terms of truth tables as follows. An argument is valid if and only if there is no row on its joint truth table where all the premises are true and the conclusion false. So by showing all of the possibilities, all the different possible combinations of truth values for the argument, um, and if we fill in all the rows, figure out the truth values for all the statements at every row, and there is no row where all the premises are true and the conclusion is false, that shows that it's impossible for such a thing to happen because we've explored all of the possibilities and we haven't found any such row. 